Hey everybody, Jabman025 here. Today I am looking at the add-on pack for the F9D, in this case, the B and the K packs. There is a pack for every letter of the alphabet, and while P Bandai has not gotten every single one out, they're slowly working their way through it. So this is the pack I decided to pick up to go with my F90, and there's lots of choices. So let's have a look and see what we got. We got the B and the K, K pack. The B stands for Bombardier. It's pretty straightforward what that does. You got these parts for the forearms. Those red parts there are painted. Uh, they do give you stickers for it. And the missiles are just painted and they don't give you anything for it. They're just plain gray. I had to do some sanding on these. It didn't do a very good paint job on them, but eventually I got it to look right. Fair bit of lining to do on this thing. Backpack. This replaces the backpack that is currently on the F90. It doesn't attach on top of it. It's just wholesale replaces. You take it off. And missile pods. We have four. One for each leg, one for each shoulder. This is a shoulder one here because you see that blue part on the side. Now, the K pack, a little simpler. You get two shoulder attachments. Each one has three eye field generators on it. So this thing has six eye field. You get this add-on to the backpack. This goes on top of the backpack that's already on the F90. And you get this big mamma jamma, a giant beam shield. You can take out that clear pink part and just have it a small handheld shield. Well, why on earth would you do that? And those little white pieces will connect into that red centerpiece. And you have a battery pack that attaches onto the back. Now, bombardier pack. See, the whole thing comes with water slide decals. This is a separate sheet. And lots of little decals on it. Some nice big ones that say the B pack. B, like I said, B stands for bombardier. So you got missiles, you got cannons, you got more missiles. You just get essentially you fly over a enemy base or an enemy uh, battleship and unleash this thing, and they have a really really bad day. Open up all the latches. The clear, the kind of the shiny blue part on each missile that's a sticker as is the camera on the outside so a little sticker heavy here nothing terrible though you can paint them if you want and quite frankly i think they look better this way anyway but yeah uh two missile pods in the legs one, one for each two missile pods on the shoulder one for each two shoulder cannons and two missile launchers on the forearm like i said the backpack wholesale replaces the one that came on the f90 I think this would look better um, up in the air, and it doesn't weigh all that much, so I don't think it'd be any trouble whatsoever getting it up there. But of the two packs, this is not my favorite, despite the fact of all the explosions and death and bombing, bombardeering, bombardeering, but whatever. Next, we have the K pack. That stands for keep, as in keep the pilot alive, or keep someone alive. I, the way this works in my head is. There's a very important person you're protecting, either in the Gundam as a passenger, or you're protecting someone in a pilot next to you or something, because you got this double battery pack, which hooks onto these latches in the back, and it connects into the back screen armor. Two cables run out to this thing, which attaches into the arm, which creates a giant beam shield. And on each shoulder, you have these attachments that come with three eye field generators on each shoulder. So we're talking a giant beam shield and six eye field generators. There's not a beam shot alive that's getting through that. So yeah, keep someone alive. Basically, if you put a skilled pilot and you put a VIP passenger in there and you give it a couple escort chips, I'm not sure how you would defeat it. Final thoughts on this kit. I'm going to give it a thumbs up, but I really like this look here. The Bombardier pack is nice, but we've seen that before. This is what happens when you take all of your stat points and put them into defense. This is a Gundam that's built to keep someone alive, nothing else. I just like the idea of an all-defense Gundam. It's got a beam saber for offense, a beam shield that would make the destiny blush, and six eye field generators. <laughs> So yeah, that's that's all defense and not much offense. For the Bombardier pack, I like it, but we've seen you know this type before. Heavy arms, there's lots of stuff that's got tons of ammo. I like it. It looks neat. It doesn't hamper posability either one. They both got good decals for them. They both look really good. 
I enjoy this little pack. The add-on packs for the F90 aren't super expensive either, so that's always nice. Well, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you found it informative. If you have any questions, please ask them. I'll answer them as best I can. Please stay tuned for more, and I'll see you guys next time. Oh, and uh, one more thing. So, exactly who are we protecting? What are we protecting that's so important? And Oh. Okay, yeah, that tracks.